The 992, now with a Targa roof. Own a piece of RWB on your wrist. 992 GT3R spied at the NUR and watch your new 911 being created. Stick around for Run 11 News after the intro. Hello and welcome to the latest round of Porsche News. I'm Sean and this is your favorite Porsche channel, Ren 11. Please don't forget to subscribe and click the bell to be notified of the latest episode as soon as it hits so you can stay ahead of the competition. First up, the 992 Generation 911 is now on sale as a Targa. Available in both Carrera 4 and 4S, you can have your coupe fix whilst enjoying open air driving. The roof takes just 19 seconds to disappear with this impressive mechanism. Incidentally, the same amount of time the late great Bill Weathers holds a note in the classic Lovely Day. A lovely day, lovely day, lovely day, lovely day. The Targa's power output matches the coupe and cab, with 0 60 time only being 0.3 seconds behind the former. It's doubtful you'll feel the difference in the real world. The Targa was first released in 1965, and the term coined by Porsche themselves, based on the legendary Targa Florio race. Targa itself means plate in Italian. You could eat your food in the roof section if you wish, I guess. Why was it created? Well, there was a concern that convertibles were to be banned for safety reasons, in case they overturned and injured the occupants. So Porsche decided to stay ahead of any legislation and led the way with this design. Although not the first of its type of roof arrangement, Porsche made it popular and then trademarked the name. Well, wouldn't you? I have had reliable information from my global source in Porsche that there is a good chance a special edition Targa will appear, think Mayfair edition, like the last generation car. Get yourself on the Porsche website and configure yours. I did. Well, what were you thinking? Of course it was going to be red. Are you excited about the new Targa? What's your preference in body style? Let us know below. Next up. Danish watchmakers Rec and Japanese Porsche tuner RWB are collaborating on a super special limited edition pair of timepieces. If you're unfamiliar with Rec, they've made a name for themselves in the watchmaking industry over the last few years, creating excellent automatic timepieces using recycled parts from planes and cars, such as the Ford Mustang, Supermarine Spitfire, and our favorite, the Porsche 911. RWB, or Raw Welt Begriff, is the infamous Japanese tuning brand known for their wide body Porsches, which divide opinion. Me? I love them. They look so aggressive with those riveted arches and that low race car stance. The 901 RWB follows on from Rex's previous efforts, taking salvaged parts from RWB owner Akira Nakai's own Stellar Artois and Rotana builds. Not only that, design cues from the vehicle in question find their way into these timepieces. Wider hips on the watch case, color-coded elements from the two RWBs, even the case back design is a mirror of the wheels from the original cars. Thomas Funder, designer of the 901 RWB watches, explains, whether you like them or not, Mr. Akira Nakai's RWB creations don't go unnoticed. You take a stand. We want to incorporate the same powerful presence into our Stella and Rotana timepieces. So now others can have a little bit of RWB in their life. However, each watch is limited to just 305 pieces, so you have to be quicker than quick to get your hands on wrists on them. Are you going to be taking the plunge and be one of the few to own this? What would you do if you could create your perfect watch and car amalgamation? Tell everyone in the comments box. Carscoops.com have spotted the new GT3R race car being tested at the Nürburgring Grand Prix circuit last week. They have some great pics of the new car, camouflaged lightly. You could see that front bumper and polarizing swan neck rear wing shared with the road going GT3, which has been seen testing for a few months now. The center lock mag wheels, skirts, and vents on the rear arches complete the look. No word on what engine will power it, but don't be surprised if it's the same or similar unit to the outgoing model. A four liter naturally aspirated motor with 542 brake and six speed sequential box. Who is excited as I am for the new GT family? What do you think we'll see shared between this and the road going RS when that is finally released to the world? Tell us all below. Lastly, Porsche are allowing their customers who order a new 911 the chance to not only see the process from build week to delivery, but you'll actually catch a glimpse of your cars on the factory being built. Track Your Dream, as it's called, will take you through the 14 stage process of a build. From the moment you order your 992 from the Porsche Center of Choice, the date you can amend the specification, build week commencement, when it's placed on the ship, and when it arrives at your center. This service is part of the web portal, My Porsche, 
the hub for your complete ownership cycle of the car, from the funding, servicing, and onboard entertainment services that is Porsche Connect. The best thing though, behind the scenes gives you access to two key parts of the build progress by camera at the 911 factory in Zuffenhausen. Imagine being able to see them fit the doors, paint the car, place that badge on the bonnet. More cameras are gonna be added soon. Both Porsche Track Your Dream and behind the scenes are live now in the UK, America, Germany, Canada, Switzerland, and Spain, and it will spread to the rest of the world soon. This service is only available on the 911, with the Taycan cited as the next car to feature. What else would you like to see going into the build of your car? Who cares about all the having this information in the first place? Let us all know in the comments section. Thank you all for watching Ren 11 News this week. Coming next on the Ren 11 YouTube channel, Tuesdays we have our live Instagram interviews with key people from the Porsche community. Want to catch them live though? Visit our page on Instagram at Ren11. The link is in the comments. We will see you next Saturday for more Porsche news. So remember to subscribe and click that bell button to be notified of the next video. Be safe, be good, and much love folks.